Hi oh guys, one other thing that was a really great surprise to see in the shipment we just received. Um, something really nice, so let's have a look at it. Guys, I want to show you this. This was sent to us by our friends at uh, Copper State, which we really appreciate because um, this is such a, and it got here in one piece, which is brilliant. This is the 35th scale H series motorcycle that uh, Copper State's doing in 3D print. There's only four parts to it because it's so well printed. It's, it's just really, really nicely done. We will probably get it in, but we won't be carrying many of it because it is 3D print. So if you want one, please let us know. It's not cheap, but um, once we get the pricing done, we'll get it up and go from there for you. But this is, this is just lovely. This is the H series, a British H series motorcycle. Um, the H series won a competition that the uh, British Army were running to find a new way for their dispatch riders rather than riding horses, they wanted a motorcycle. It was produced, uh, about 30,000 of them produced during World War One. A lot of the Allies used, used them and everything else. Uh, an interesting story about this is that at the end of the war, uh, they took them back to the company that produced them and had them a whole lot of them refurbished and sold back out onto the civilian market, which is a bit different. Um, and the production finally finished in about 1923 after building about after having about 50,000 of them built. So that's quite uh, quite a motorcycle. But as a 3D print, this is just phenomenal. All that there's nothing that's not part of the 3D print. All the spokes, everything in it is just 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 superb. It's just lovely. But as I said, it is 3D printed, so you've got to make a decision whether you can cope with all the bits and pieces you've got to do and the clean up and everything else. And as I said, it's not going to be cheap for a 35th scale motorbike, but if you want something of this style, it's the only way to go at the moment. So there you go. This will be on show at the shop and also at the Model Expo in a couple of weeks. There you go.